One of the region's air ambulances is moving to a new home. The Great North Air Ambulance has three helicopters, including one base near Penrith. Another is on Teesside, but work has now begun to move it into a new multi-million pound base, which will be amongst the first of its kind in the world, as Amy Lee reports. Um, Training to save lives. This was just an exercise for the Great North Air Ambulance paramedics based at Tees Valley Airport. But soon this type of thing will be happening a few miles away at a brand new home. Well, it's been a long time in the making. The first concept we've ever had goes back to 2010, so it's been a long time. But yeah, um, the public largely in the main have enabled all of this, but the public will certainly benefit from it as well. These former chemical company offices in Erle Nook in Eaglescliff will house all those working for the Great North Air Ambulance. Funded with a mix of government grants and fundraising, it'll cost just over £2 million in total and some staff could be ready to move in in just 40 weeks' time. Well, this is where the paramedics are going to be based. So if you make a 999 call to the Great North Air Ambulance, it's going to come through here. Now, what's convenient about it is it's going to be based right next to the brand new air hangar where the helicopters will also be based right outside. But that's not the only exciting thing in store for the future of this building. If we take a look over here, so directly opposite where the paramedics will be based, this part of the building is going to be transformed into what they're saying will be a world-class pre-hospital medical care centre. And it's hoped that paramedics will come from all over the world pay to be trained here by the Great North Air Ambulance paramedics. So those staff will be trained on Teesside to save lives right across the world. It's hoped the new training centre will mean more people like Alicia, who's visiting from Sydney, can spend time with local crews. Um, being hands-on is always a good way to learn rather than learning from textbooks. Um, and these guys are so friendly that it makes it a bit easier to ask the stupid questions. Ready to save lives, no matter where they're flying from. Amy Lee, ITV News.